I had the pleasure of meeting Brad for the first time in beautiful Chase, British Columbia in May of 2016. Um, when he decided to brutalize the most important part of my body with the blade of his stick. Um, so, of course, my response was to turn around and attempt to knock his ugly buck teeth straight out of his mouth with my stick. Unfortunately, I was unsuccessful. <laughs> um, directly after this cowardly stick work occurred, there was a mutual agreement to uh, settle this dispute with our fists. Well, more so with Brad's fists and my forehead. <laughs> um, most people who have seen the fight and the bumps on my forehead afterwards would probably say that Brad won the battle. And I'd probably agree. But I'd also like to point out the fact that the next game I was playing, and he was in the stands with T-Rex hands because both hands were in casts. <laughs> Lactose intolerance is a son of a bitch, eh, Brad? Holy fuck. <laughs> Anyways, oh yeah, so more to the point of our story. A couple years down the road and uh, life had taken us back to beautiful Okotoks, Alberta to play on the same team and uh, put that incident behind us. Uh, although Brad does like to remind everyone every once in a while that he kicked my ass. So, but this is the time that I actually really got to know who Brad is. And uh, he's that big strawberry blonde teddy bear that can't eat cheese and he really enjoys candlelit ba bubble bass a little too much. <laughs> it keeps me humble knowing that this guy kicked my ass. <laughs> We've been friends ever since these two got together and inseparable ever since. <laughs> Hannah has dreamt of this day literally since the very beginning and I have had the privi privilege to watch these two grow individually and as a couple throughout high school to college and now young adult life. <laughs> We've been there for each other through the highest of highs and the lowest of lows and every milestone in between. <laughs> This is like, okay. For a few years before Adam, I was their third wheel for literally everything. <laughs> to love you forever and always and be your rock when things get tough. I promise to continue to push your buttons and poke fun just to hear you laugh. I promise to not complain too much about cleaning bathrooms or how much shopping you like to do. <laughs> I promise above all else to build a life together, you and I. I'll choose you forever and always. This is the beginning of the next chapter for us, and I have no doubts you'll be a great wife. And me, a great husband to you. <laughs> I can't wait for our future to watch you become a mother, and for us to grow old and gray together. I love you to the moon and back, forever and always. <laughs> And Brad, you guys have built a wonderful life together, and today is just one of the many celebrations you will have together. Congratulations to Brad and Hannah. When I look at you, I see love, I see joy, and I see the 16 year old boy I fell in love with. <laughs> From day one, you've been my comfort, my calm, and my constant, and I've always been your crazy. 
I used to think I needed a love to complete me, but you showed me I was already whole. You've taught me to let the hard stuff roll off my shoulders because you'd always be there to make sure I'm okay. Whatever obstacle comes our way, I know you'll never walk out or leave and that is one of the greatest comforts you could ever give me. I will never forget what a privilege it is to be loved by you. Getting to spend the rest of my life with you, my best friend, is all I could ever ask for. I want you for the rest of my days. I love you to the moon and back. Any one of these people in here, Hannah, at any time, you can phone. It's hard for me too. So I'm not as bad as Dwayne, but.